Lua collaborated with the Pentagon's entity in charge of investigating anomalous events. Together, they released an informative outline suggesting the possibility that extraterrestrial spacecraft may have at some point visited our solar system. Several celestial objects have been located in the vicinity of our solar system, but recently an unexpected visitor has made its appearance again. This visitor, named Oumuamua, entered our solar system from a location beyond the stars in 2017 and has sparkled a great interest among astronomers globally. The return of Oumuamua raises questions about its presence, what its significance might be, and what additional observations we might conduct. We invite you to watch this video to the end to get answers of all the questions that may arise. If we take into account the immensity of the universe and the vast space it encompasses, humans and our planet Earth represent only a small fraction. This is why we have devoted years to effort to exploring space. Throughout these years, we have explored the cosmos from Earth using high-capability telescopes that allows us to observe considerable distances in space and large objects that are beyond the reach of our eyes. When these measurements were not sufficient, the use of space telescope became an alternative. Telescopes such as the Hubble Space Telescope and the James Watt Space Telescope are intended to observe and collect information from outer space. These devices were conceived to overcome the obstacles and limitations that come close to terrestrial telescopes, such as the usual interference, the presence of foreign objects and even possible visitors. Since their launch, these telescopes have revealed numerous findings in space including the capture of images of a large object in space and the detection of a visitor coming from a considerable distance. This visitor, known as Oumuamua, is an object of interesting and peculiar origin that passes through our solar system. Its trajectory took it from another system to our own, being detected by astronomer Robert Warwick on October 19, 2017. The discovery was carried out using the telescope located at the Haleakala Observatory in Hawaii. Oumuamua presented an elongated appearance resembling a cigar-shaped object in space notable for its striking size. Its radius spanned about 200 meters and its length exceeded 10 times its width. These dimensions are exceptional when considering its presence in the interior of our solar system. Normally, our minds associate celestial objects with spherical shapes, influenced by the gravitational forces operating within them. To a large extent, Objects tend to take on spherical configurations due to gravitational attraction, which keeps atoms in a compact, round arrangement. However, what gave rise to the peculiar shape of Oumuamua is still not well understood. Several explanations have been proposed to address this enigma. Some theories suggest that it may be acquired escaped from interactions with other objects in stellar space, such as the collisions of gravitational encounters. Another possibility is that its configuration is a result of a process related to planetary formation, perhaps having taken shape in a stellar system before being ejected into interstellar space. There is also the conjecture that its structure may have arisen from a hitherto unknown process. Whatever the cause, the unusual shape of Oumuamua contributes to its enigmatic nature, uncovering great curiosity among the scientific community. In addition, Oumuamua was shown to spin and rotate in regular patterns, an unusual behavior for solar objects. This peculiar rotation adds even more mystery to its characteristics. Loeb raised the prospect that Oumuamua might actually be an interstellar probe sent by an advanced terrestrial civilization. In this context, he suggests that this object could have been sent for the purpose of exploring our solar system. His arguments has sparkled intense debate and incited speculation regarding the possible existence of life beyond Earth and the consequences this would have for humanity. Although this theory lacks hard evidence to support it, it has generated considerable interest and has prompted consideration of other alternatives to Oumuamua. Since no evidence has been found to strongly support this hypothesis, Oumuamua remains an enigma 
surrounded by conjecture. Among the remaining possibilities, is the likelihood that it's either a fragment from a colliding planet or a torn fragment of a comet that was affected by solar gravity. Although Loeb's arguments has attracted attention, it is not definitive in affirming the presence of extraterrestrial intelligence among us, nor in the confirming the existence of intelligent neighbors on other planets. Several alternative theories which lack solar support continue to be considered regarding Oumuamua and its origins. In 2023, two astronomers saw Oumuamua approaching Earth and decided to collaborate on an investigation in which they posited a possible return with disproportionate acceleration of this mysterious object. The theory proposes that this acceleration could be caused by the release of hydrogen gas from its surface. As this gas is released from the object, it generates a force that propels Oumuamua. Although this acceleration is striking, its origin is related to the gravitational interactions they experience with the Sun and other planets along the journey through our solar system. Researchers developed the hydrogen gas hypothesis as a possible explanation for this phenomenon. This theory is based on the notion that Oumuamua is comparable to a comet releasing gas as it moves through our solar system. They suggest that Oumuamua is largely composed of hydrogen ice that formed in an interstellar space and became trapped in the object due to cosmic radiation over millions of years. As Oumuamua approaches the Sun, the heat from the Sun causes the hydrogen ice to go directly from solids to gaseous in a process called sublimation. The release of gaseous hydrogen would escape from the object's surface, uncovering a modest but steady thrust. This would ultimately contribute to Oumuamua's acceleration and could explain how it gained the surprising amount of momentum that it carried it away from the Sun as it moved along its trajectory. If this hypothesis turns out to be true, it is likely that the gas released by Oumuamua is hydrogen, the lightest and most abundant element in the entire universe. Furthermore, Given the relatively low temperatures of Oumuamua compared to that of the Sun, it is likely that some of the hydrogen released is in this molecular form rather than in its atomic form. In this molecular form, hydrogen may be more effective in generating momentum than in its atomic form. The hydrogen gas theory follows one of the most widely accepted features regarding Oumuamua, supported in part by several observations. For example, the elongated shape of the object is consistent with the possibility that it is covered by a layer of hydrocarbon ice that has been stretched by the sun's gravity. In addition, Oumuamua showed no signs of typical comet or asteroid activity, such as dust or gas emission, which is consistent with the idea that it could be an object composed primarily of hydrogen rather than a comet. Although the hydrogen gas theory has certain limitations, such as the challenge of explaining how the gas could escape from the object's surface without being hindered by gravity. It remains a valuable explanation for understanding the acceleration observed in Oumuamua. Despite its possible inconsistencies, this theory provides significant insight into elucidating the factors that may influence the object's acceleration. Let us know what you think in the comments box. If you liked the video, hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss more content like this. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.